hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome to talk on sun it's me Ogeichi. so this video is created as part of the self-care series i have been doing on my channel for the past month or so you should go to my channel and check them out just so you know this series will be coming to an end soon and i will be focusing on other topics of interest for this video i'll be sharing home care nail tips nail beauty tips on how you can achieve a long lasting nail polish that stays on your natural nails and grows your natural nails at the same time without visiting a nail technician or breaking the bank trying to keep up appearance I don't know about you but I have always struggled to grow my nails or to maintain my nail polish to last long okay because my nails are very soft and they become bristol very quickly and whenever it shows any sign of growth it chips on its own and sometimes I just cut it off myself so growing my nails has been something that is a struggle and also maintaining my nail polish has equally been a struggle as my nails are sharp and chip anytime so it gets frustrating and then I just chip them all off or cut them all off so having nail polish that doesn't last also makes it more frustrating because when I have my nails nail polish on it helps me to leave the nails to grow on its own and it also prevents um, chipping to some extent anyways <laughs> I have tried acrylics and though it grows my nose it makes it more bristle as well and that's once you've taken it, taken it off and one day I will send my nail salon a local nail salon to get my nails manicured and get some nail polish and the nail polish that she used was quite interesting because that did not rub off and kept my nails very long actually for quite a long period of time I believe that nail polish lasted about a month before I wanted to take it out and I struggled to do so and I couldn't take it out with normal nail remover so I went back to the technician to ask for something to remove the nails she that's when she told me that she used nail um, gel I've tried to use gel but I find it frustrating that I can't easily take it out and have to go through processes of putting foils and others to take them off. So I've discovered for myself a way to maintain a nail polish that lasts long without all the fuss and using products I already have without breaking the bank. So for this video I've decided to share some, some of the tips and things that you can do to get a longer lasting nail polish on your nails and that doesn't chip easily or rub off easily so the first thing that you have to do is to manicure your nails and that's by removing the dead skin around your cuticle areas of your nails uh, on uh, the perimeters of it and also um, filing your nails and removing any other excess dead skin and using um, some sort of alcoholic nail pot remover to remove any excess shine alternatively I use one of those soft nail filers to um, remove it as this helps the nails nail polish to stick on your nails better without rubbing off easily so the idea is to leave your nails dry before you start applying it so manicure your nails first um, filing and removing any chip edges so that it looks good okay then you can do this on dry or soaked nails but my nail technician says dry nails is better than soaked nails as it makes it last your nail polish last longer so after you finish doing that you go to apply your nail base coat 
and base coats can come up in different brands and different forms so you can not gel though just put your base coat and um, i usually use barium which you can see it has the base and top coat at the same time as you can use both as this helps to harden up the nails as well so once you've put that cure it in the uv led nail lamp for about i say 30 seconds okay cure it on there and then apply your favorite nail polish as you wish try not to go over the cuticle areas or too close to the cuticle areas that it goes over your skin i mean if you're not good at it it doesn't really matter <laughs> i'm not good at putting my nail polish but i discovered when you do that it helps to keep everything neat and tidy so once you apply your favorite nail varnish color make sure you get a quality one you can also get a poundland one really doesn't matter just get a nail polish uh, of your favorite color apply it cure it again for about for me it depends on the um, uv led light nail lamp light you have uh, mine usually takes longer to cure so if you get a really good quality one it can take seconds so usually i leave mine for about 90 seconds and then bring it out again and put the base coat on top and then cure it again if for a longer period this time i kind of leave it for about 10 minutes to ensure that it's cured and hard and dry so if it's not you can leave it longer and then there you go you have beautiful nails that you want to show to everyone and um, that you will love as well so pretty much that's my advice if you have any better advice or more advice to add to this advice share below thanks for watching and don't forget to share and subscribe if you like this video take care bye